Hey guys, um, we're just having a look at the uh, TNT uh, barrel cylinder before uh, before we fit it. I've uh, I've chamfered the uh, the ports. You can see there just a small chamfer. Um, it apparently does help uh, gas flow, and it also um, aids the uh, life of the rings. So um, yeah, each port has got a, a small a small chamfer. Uh, on its window. Um, the top and bottom of this exhaust port has been uh, ground out, so it's round now. And um, this aids the, um, this should aid the, the, the exhaust flow um, there, like this. So it's nice and smooth. Um, it didn't it wasn't smooth before so that should help the exhaust flow and that's been polished a little bit on the inside and here at the bottom these um, struts here, these supports, whatever they are casting in the middle which were very big and bulky and um, what we've done is we've just slimmed the entry points down so that uh, it should be, there should, there should be less turbulence and we've also, as you can see, polished them and the same there and the same uh, this one because they were a bit a bit sc uh, scrappy as well so that's the extent of um of the tnt um mods just some minor uh minor mods really uh, that might might help uh piston this is the piston that came with the kit um, it already had um, a larger chamfer on the inlet side to the um, to the exhaust, and all I've done is, in fact, just helped form that. There's a very straight chamfer, and what I've done is I've helped form much better radius around the top here, so that um, so that the gas flow is going to be much smoother than just a straight chamfer, which was fine, but we've just tickled it a bit. And so, yeah, that's it. Uh, it would have been nice if they'd given us a little bit more um, of this, another 5 milli, for welding onto the exhaust, because it's, it's, it's pretty tight. But there we go, that's the TNT kit. We'll compare it to the, um, to the other barrel when we get it off. All right, bye for now.